Why don't the 5,900X and 5,950X ever play hide and seek? Because no matter where they hide, the bottleneck always finds them. And now, let us look at 11 critical differences between the two. Let's compare the differences between the 5,900X and the 5,950X. Difference one, the primary and most noticeable difference is the number of processing cores. The AMD Ryzen 9 5,900X has 12 cores, while the Ryzen 9 5,950X comes with 16 cores. This means the 5,950X can handle multi-threaded tasks more efficiently, such as 3D rendering or simultaneously running many applications. Difference two, following on from cores, the number of threads is different as well. The 5,900X has 24 threads, whereas the 5,950X boasts 32 threads. A greater number of threads allows for better multitasking, crucial for intense workloads like video editing or software development. Difference three, the 5,950X also has a slightly higher thermal design power, TDP, of 105W compared to the 5,900X's 105W, which means it uses slightly more power and may require better cooling arrangements. Difference four, with regards to the cache, the 5,950X has a larger L3 cache of 64 MB compared to the 5,900X's 64 MB. A larger cache allows for faster data access and improved performance in memory-dependent applications. Difference 5. The maximum temperature the processors can handle also has a discrepancy, with the 5900X having a maximum temperature of 90 degrees C and the 5950X only 85 degrees C. This suggests the 5950X may run hotter and require more cooling. Difference 6. When factoring in cost, the 5950X is notably more expensive. The higher price tag is justified by the increase in cores, threads and performance, but makes the 5900X a more cost-effective choice for those on a tighter budget. Difference 7. The base clock speed of the 5950X is slightly lower than the 5900X. The 5950X's is 3.4 GHz, while the 5900X's is 3.7 GHz. However, this difference is practically negligible in most use cases. Difference 8. The 5950X has a higher maximum boost clock speed of 4.9 GHz compared to the 5900X's 4.8 GHz. This indicates the 5950X has slightly higher short-term performance for things like games or apps that require a one-time quick computational push. Difference 9. The single core performance of the 5950X is slightly better than the 5900X owing to its higher clock speeds. This can lead to better performance in tasks that cannot be parallelized. Difference 10. The 5950X supports ECC, error correction code, memory, whereas the 5900X doesn't. ECC memory can detect and correct common types of data corruption, which offers a more stable and reliable computing experience, particularly important for servers or critical data workloads. Difference 11. Lastly, in terms of architecture, both CPUs are built on the 7NM Zen 3 architecture, but the 5950X is equipped with superior multitasking capabilities. Thus, despite the same architecture, their performance varies, especially in terms of handling multi-threaded tasks.